Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul video. So if you missed last week's video, I did do a Dollar Tree haul. Lots of really cool Valentine's goodies, some name brand goodies, some things for your nails, some just some fun stuff. Check out that haul video. I'll link it at the end of this one. But I'm pretty excited there were some really good deals. Now, if you're not aware, the Dollar Tree, or at least most stores, are currently at $1.25 per item. Although I'm hearing from a lot of you out there, your store is still at a dollar. So lucky ducks out there, take advantage of that discounted price while you can. But I'm gonna dive into my haul with a couple of name brand deals that I did grab this week. So they did have the eight pack bar of the Nutri-Grain bars. This is the strawberry, apple cinnamon, and mixed berry. Now definitely for eight bars, dollar and 25 cents, this is a really good deal. Sometimes you can get them a little bit cheaper, especially if you're a member of like Sam's or Costco, you can buy them in bulk. They will come out a little bit cheaper, but if you just want eight bars, $1.25 is a great price. This is another name brand item that I found in the personal care section. I have not seen this before, but let me tell you, there are a ton of those soft soap, 32 ounce, refill bottles of hand soap so if you need those that was in last week's video there's still a ton at my store those organizational items though a little heads up they're completely gone there were none at my store so people swoop those up hopefully they'll get some more in stock and hopefully you guys can find them too because that was like the best find last week but these are the yardley uh disposable washcloths they're alcohol free they are a large size washcloth um, and they're 18 count, so they're 12 inches by um, eight inches. They are not flushable wipes, so keep that in mind, but um, a new find to go ahead and take advantage of. Um, stickers, there's a lot of new stickers at Dollar Tree. They're so cute. I love stickers um, whenever I'm sending cards or especially for my planner, that's my number one thing, um, just to put a little sticker on, it just, just makes me happy so here we have these really cute little owl stickers so if you love owls and birds check that out how cute are those love the colors um, love the dimension because they definitely have the pop-up effect so if you enjoy that and then if you check the Valentine's Day section they have some cute stickers so if your kids are making homemade valentines and maybe you want a couple stickers for the outside of the card you could take advantage this is a 53 piece sticker set there's really some cute ones i'm going to kind of turn it sideways like the peanut butter and jelly is so cute and then they have the cute little birds and the milk uh the uh cookie and the milk there are really sweet the little bee so definitely fun if you're doing anything like homemade valentine so we are all about like games and having fun, um, any kind of games we enjoy playing as a family. And they have these card, these two different card games that I thought would be really cute. They had actually a lot, you know, like Old Maid and Goldfish. Um, but these were different games. Now this particular one is for ages six to eight. So my kids are definitely a little bit older, but we're like a talking family. So we like to talk about like when I grew up or when my husband grew up, my kids love to hear that. So as long as they're asking, we still want to tell them that information. And it's it's a good way to bond with your kids. Um, so this is called Mixed Emojis, and it's just different emoji cards. So it recognizes emotions and expressing emotions and memory. And especially with my kids now, again, my kids are older. My daughter is 11. My son is 14. But it's really good for public speaking as far as, you know, you can pick out an emoji card. Let me see if they show you what it's like. Yeah, it just gives you an emoji card and then you just give an example of a time when you felt that way. So a time when you felt silly or a time when you felt happy and just getting them to talk through it because sometimes kids are really quick to answer where they just want to say, I'm fine or that was funny, but to elaborate on a situation, I think this would be a fun game for us. And this one is interesting too, because this is two to eight players, and this is actually for ages seven and older. And it's more of like a math game, so I guess you have to like get a certain amount of numbers and have them add up to a number but not go over, and you have to do it like maybe in a timely manner. I'm not 100% sure, but again, it's another game that kind of has all of us thinking which is not a bad thing for myself and my husband either because we need that for our brains to keep going 
This is an awesome find. So my daughter loves the little skateboards. They have them in Target. Um, and they usually run around $4.99 per skateboard, or if you're getting a two pack, it's $9.99. So I thought that these would be really cute for her to go ahead and test test out and see how she likes them. She likes to display them too, because if you look at them, a lot of them have really cute designs. Like this has a really pretty leaf pattern. Um, so each package comes with the skateboard and then it comes with an accessory, like a ramp or something that you can go ahead and use. And it just kind of shows you on the back. So I grabbed two of these. Here's another one. Very cute and really for a dollar, all four of these items, you know, for $5 is a steal. So I'm gonna be honest, at the Dollar Tree signage is probably at one of its best points, or at least I feel that way. There are so many cute signs to choose from. So I found these cute little heart, kind of like steel pattern here um, with the gnomes on them. So this one says, I love you. There is some glitter effect to it and the gnome is kind of popped out. So I love when everything isn't flush or a printed type decor piece because it definitely looks like it's more expensive, at least in my book. And this has a really cute little burlap uh, bow here to go with it. So I grabbed this and then they also had the three pack of gnomes. Um, these types of decor, I, we have like a little bathroom where I have two pictures that are up throughout the year. And then holiday seasons, I find pieces to interchange with it. So these are perfect to kind of interchange for a Valentine's Day theme. And then I can go back to the original pictures when Valentine's Day is over. If I want to put something up for Easter, I always do fall and Christmas for sure. Um, but yeah, those are super fun. So look out for those. And then they had a lot of really cute little like girly bedroom accessory, just fun items to choose from. These, are, this is really cute. There's actually two. This first one says, let's chill with the ice cream cone with the cute little sunglasses. This would be great on a desk, on a nightstand, on a little shelf, a bookcase, anything to kind of display it. And then this one is really cute too. It says, you're cool. Again, it's got the eyeglasses popping out there. Fun colors, really pretty. Um, just little pieces and then they had these which I thought would be really cute on a wall um, Again in a little, you know girly type bedroom, but they have the ice cream cone sweet love That is really cute and then they have this one which goes perfect with the um, your cool little display piece that I showed you the little um, rainbow with the clouds check out how cute and happy those clouds are so definitely some fun interchangeable pieces that you can go ahead and change up your house decor a couple more goodies to go let me know in the comments how you are enjoying or not enjoying the Dollar Tree are you seeing good items at your store is it still kind of blah are you happy or oh, you're, nobody's happy with paying $1.25, but are you okay with paying $1.25? Let me know in the comments, very interested, or have you just completely stopped going to Dollar Tree because of the price hike? Everything seems to be going up in price. I guess my whole theory is there's still a lot of value. I'm gonna go in there and grab things that I know I'm gonna be using that are not gonna be sitting in a tote and maybe I'll use them. It's either I'm gonna put them up now or I'm not gonna buy them. So that's kind of my mindset. But I love these little pieces. This is a little love sign. Um, I do not use these outside because it's just not big enough. Um, and you know, how much bigger of a sign could you get for $1.25? I love the little burlap piece, the heart for the O for the love. Um, I like these little pieces to kind of just prop up in corners. I have a couple of different shelves in um, one of our family rooms where it can kind of angle on a corner and you can just put it there and put some little decorations. Again, I don't do a lot of decorating for Valentine's Day, but just putting up a, you know, a couple of fun pieces can make it festive and enjoyable. So last haul, I found some really cute bags, burlap bags for my daughter for gift giving. And then I found these. These are a little bit smaller. So if you're looking for little treats for like the teachers, just to maybe put, I got, um, six of them. So I'm thinking for the kids, I'm just going to put like a coffee gift card. I'm going to look on Etsy for something cute or a cute idea, but um, I figured just a little coffee gift card and maybe a couple of little candies. I'm going to open them up for you guys 
So they have them in red and they also have them in the pink. I'm trying to open up the pink here. Three per bag. These are perfect for like a cute little gift card and maybe something else. There's not a lot of room in there or even just a couple pieces of candy, um, you know, some gum. I'm trying to think of just different little things that you might put in there. So I did grab these for the teachers. I think these are really cute. Sometimes at Target Dollar Spot you can find something, but again, I am getting three for $1.25. So very excited. I think those other burlap bags from last week's video, my daughter is really excited to start filling them for her friends. Um, always seem to find these cute little jar pieces for each and every season. Love them. Again, it's a perfect kind of like mix for little things that I'm putting up. This one says, it's kind of hard to read the way that the glitter is. Home is wherever we are together. I really like this saying, but I just find that it's too light with this glitter. I wish it was, you know, even with like in black where it would stick out or a different color, maybe gray. But again, it has the little burlap, you know, extras here and the little steel piece on there that makes it look like a jar. So pretty darn cute. And speaking of pretty darn cute, these were pretty, I haven't opened these yet. And I think I'm going to, well, let me show you them first. Look at these. So you can definitely put these on like a door, you know, as a decoration. Um, I'm thinking for myself. Um, for my daughter to give one and maybe she can use it to um, I'll kind of like glue some of those little clothespins. Um, I got a pack of them because I put all my Christmas cards on our doors throughout our house. So I use those mini clothespins to hold them up. But I thought to just put a couple clothespins and she can, you know, put pictures of the family, pictures of her cousins on there and just have like a little photo kind of thing. But it's really pretty because check out the flowers that are in there. Um, so they had these two designs, so that is definitely an idea, and I may do that for my office for the other one. See, that's the thing, like, with making this just a little photo frame for $1.25. I mean, it just makes it cute, fun. It's something where if my daughter, you know, takes it down after Valentine's Day and doesn't want to have anything to do with it, it's okay. But it kind of gets us thinking, like, what can we use these items for? Because in the past, I bought so many decor pieces that we didn't even use and some that we tossed, which was terrible to say, but we tossed them. So um, keep that in mind. Try and be creative with the kids. Um, if you like air fresheners, this is the Emoji Smellies. Really cute. Um, never tried it before. Not my favorite scent. The only scent they had was lavender, and this is Loving Lavender. But definitely really cute. You can see it's got the little clip, so it goes in the little vent there. Air freshener, we'll see how that goes. And then some select stores are already getting out Easter items. So these are some of my favorite Easter items. I love these carrots. There's so many things that you can do with these carrots. Um, whether you're just using them for little decor pieces in um, a restroom or if you're making it kind of like a coffee station bar, if you have one and you change it out seasonally, you can put some of those in there. You can use some of the cracked eggs in there. Just makes it look fun and you know, you can change it out each season. So that is my Dollar Tree haul video. So yes, definitely the Dollar Tree hauls are getting smaller um, just due to the price increase, but still some great value, still some fun pieces um, and all of that good stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're into money saving, then this is the channel to subscribe to. I do a lot of money saving videos, um, whether it's showing you how to money save at specific stores or giving you breakdowns each and every week to take out the work so that you guys can just go ahead and grab this savings. So I hope that you'll subscribe if you haven't. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.